Sure what's up guys, today I built something really cool, a smart desk dustbin with a satisfying RS mechanism lid that opens up like some futuristic gadget straight out of a sci-fi movie. First of all, I fired up Fusion 360 and started working on the prototype. After a lot of tweaking, this right here is my final design, hope it works. Let's slice it, print it and find out. The print came out super clean, I'm honestly excited to put it all together, so let's go. There we have it. I wasn't expecting it to work perfectly on the first try but here we are. It's running buttery smooth and I'm genuinely so happy with how it turned out. Now I can finally move forward but before we dive in, a big shout out to Altium for sponsoring this video. If you are into electronic design like me, you need to check out Altium Designer. It's an industry leading PCB design software that brings your circuit to life with powerful tools but the real game changer Altium 365. It connects to your entire workflow to the cloud so you can collaborate with your team, access your design from anywhere and even share progress with clients in real time. No back and forth emails or lost files. Whether you're a hobbyist, a student or a pro, Altium Designer paired with Altium 365 makes PCB design smarter, faster and way more fun. Check out the link in the description to start your free trial and 25% off. Alright, back to the build. Here's my custom design desk bin. I used multiple filament colors to give it that fun and eye-catching look. Now let's slice the models and begin with the printing. It might not be most useful thing in the world but hey, it's fun and nerdy experiment. Alright, look at all these 3D printed parts. This is going to be so satisfying to assemble, so let's get into it. Alright, we are halfway through and it's already looking pretty cool, now it's time to bring some electronics. Here we got an MG90S servo motor to handle the iris style opening, an ultrasonic sensor and the brain of the operation the good old Arduino Nano. Let's pop these components into place and bring this build to life. Okay, it's time to add this to the build. You can do that by following this diagram but I wanna make this project neat and clean so I decided to add a custom PCB. So I designed this simple PCB and ordered it from GLC PCB, one of the most affordable and reliable PCB manufacturer out there. Starting at just $2 for 5 PCBs, they offer fast production, great quality and worldwide shipping. Beside PCBs, they also offer various other services like PCB assembly, SMT stencils, 3D printing, CNC machining and more. Just upload your Gerber file, select your PCB specs and place your order. 
The PCB arrived within a week and as always the quality is top notch. Now without wasting any more time, let's place the components. Ok guys the main board is now complete, I even added a charging module and battery holder to make it fully rechargeable. Just one thing left, the codes. It's pretty simple so let's just upload it and fire this thing up. I have forgotten to design a mount for the PCB so for now I am going with the legendary double sided tape hack, works every time. Finally guys, we are done. The project is officially complete. Let's power it on and see it in action. As you can see, it's working beautifully. The motion is super smooth and the automatic opening is spot on, just as I expected. The top lid is like container style so you can place some stuff on it. Perfect for desk setup. If you wanna try it out, all the STL file, code and PCB files are down in the description. Got an idea for what should I make next? Drop in the comments. I read every single one. Thanks for watching and if you enjoyed the video hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already and I'll catch you in the next one until then, bye bye.